we're doing Lesson 36 from the workbook of A Course in Miracles. Lesson 36. My holiness envelops everything I see. My holiness envelops everything I see. Today's idea extends the idea for yesterday from the perceiver to the perceived. Yesterday was Lesson 35. My mind is part of God's. I am very holy. You are holy because your mind is part of God's. And because you are holy, your sight must be holy as well. Sinless means without sin. You cannot be without sin a little. You are sinless or not. If your mind is part of God's, you must be sinless or a part of his mind would be sinful. Your sight is related to his holiness, not to your ego, and therefore not to your body. Four three to five minutes, minute practice periods are required for today. Try to distribute them fairly evenly and make the shorter applications frequently to protect your protection throughout the day. The longer practice periods should take this form. First, close your eyes and repeat the idea for today several times slowly. Then open your eyes and look quite slowly about you, applying the idea specifically to whatever you note in your casual survey. Say, for example, my holiness envelops that rug. My holiness envelops that wall. My holiness envelops these fingers. My holiness envelops that chair. My holiness envelops that body. My holiness envelops that pen. Several times during these practice periods, close your eyes and repeat the idea to yourself. Then open your eyes and continue as before. For the shorter exercise periods, close your eyes and repeat the idea. Look about you as you repeat it again and conclude with one more repetition with eyes closed. All applications should, of course, be, be made quite slowly, as effortlessly and unhurriedly as possible. That's lesson 36. My holiness envelops everything I see. If you'd like to read my commentary on the workbook lessons this year, just go to amytorresasim.com and click